Hi guys, in this video tutorial I'm going to show you the media player that can read anything. That's right, it, it, it can read any video file and any um, sound or music file. M4V, MP, MPEG, MPEG, what, whatever, name it, just name it. Uh, it's called VLT Media Player and um, the link to download it will be in the description. Uh, what I would rate it is 4.5 out of 5. Why? Because the interface and the icon really, I don't, I'm really bad, I mean, I don't really like it. So, let's just go and Google for a second, and we're going to type in Video LAN, or the link is going to be in the description. You'll come to VideoLAN.org, and click Download. So here, we uh, click View Image, or can we zoom in? And uh, you'll see that's basically how it looked in the previous versions, but it doesn't really look like that anymore. And here you have the amount of downloads. This is, uh, this is an incredible amount of downloads. 3.1 downloads per second. So 3.1 uh, people are clicking download for any of these things every second. It, it's, it's weird. I mean, it's big really so just click it download for windows or mac os x or any os you have it even works for a gnu or a linux so yeah pretty good so let's basically open we'll see so that's how it looks um just going to put it up you can use the wheel to put up your volume or put it down pretty useful I say I mean I've used that a lot uh, you can make playlists you can go back and forth in the playlist you've made uh, it's not as as playlistable as, if you can call it like that as iTunes is um, iTunes is more easy and simple but it's just a simple media player to view movies so you have language you can edit it to anything classic look complete with no information area <laughs> All the things, audio, video, all those display, full screen, always on top. All all those things mean codec, codex, codex. Subtitles and OST, you can actually just right click. If you're watching a DVD and it has subtitles or audio, which it probably has, just right click and uh, select uh, subtitles you want. I, I never use Windows Media Player, never. Uh, I use iTunes. Um, for uh, music, but I use this for anything that has to do with uh, movies because I don't know Windows Media Player. Uh, really, the interface is good, but there are files you cannot read, and sometimes it has older versions and codecs and one thing and the other. Always problems. VLC, a little pro program that hasn't even reached the first. I mean. 1.0 version yet. It's on 0.9 or 0.8. I don't remember. I mean, this is a great program. You should really try it out. So, yeah, that's basically VLC Media Player of Videoland. Thanks for watching. Uh, please comment the video if you liked it or have any questions. If you liked it, rate it 5 stars. If you didn't, uh, rate it under 5 stars. Uh, please subscribe to my partners, AlexLA09 and Tech Eclipse. And please just subscribe to my uh, channel. It would help me really, really much. So, thanks again.